afternoon. Happy Friday. This is Sean LaBelle of the Decker Hewitt Group. Uh, North American markets were decidedly in the green this week, despite a bit of a scare on Tuesday when uh, President Trump announced that there would be no fiscal package until after the U.S. election. Uh, he, of course, reversed course and uh, markets were off to the races for the balance of the week. Uh, right now, it's important to note that it's not necessarily the um, uh, COVID-19 that's deciding the direction of the markets. In fact, these fiscal and monetary packages, uh, right now we've had the monetary package out of uh, the U.S. Federal Reserve. We're going to get the fiscal package out of the United States government. It's just a matter of when and how much. Uh, so this week's Market Watch Weekly dives into that conversation a little bit, along with the uh, four focal points of our uh, fundamental bullish thesis, that being that inflation decides the direction of Fed policy. Uh, right now we have zero inflation from around the world. Fed policy decides the uh, money supply. Uh, right now with 0% interest rates, the world's awash with very cheap, if not free, cash. And then uh, the money supply decides the direction of the economy. Again, right now we have a lot of money in the system, so businesses and governments are free to spend as much as they like. Uh, that generally props up the economy. And lastly, the economy decides the direction of earnings per share. Uh, we're two quarters removed from now the worst recession of our lifetime, albeit very brief. Uh, but already now forward earnings per share uh, revisions are going higher uh, with a lot of um, uh, companies now guiding for a full recovery in Q1, uh, Q1 of uh, 2022, uh, if not uh, 2021 at the earliest. Uh, so that'll do it for this week's Market Watch weekly video comment. Uh, hope everyone has a happy Thanksgiving and enjoys the long weekend and we will talk to you again next week. Cheers.